Hello, yes, why standing in elections wins hearts and minds. That's right, my hard work in Kensington is now beginning to pay off. The latest leaflets I've been putting out in Kensington has my email address and mobile phone number on it. I've been receiving emails as well as phone calls. The phone calls are very interesting and also promising. When people first call, they're listening to them and they're full of emotion and anger and frustration. And I listen to them and they tell me all their problems, what's happening in the ward. And then I give them my solutions as to what should be happening, right? And then you get a rapport with them before you know it. The voices calm down, all the emotions gone out of you. You're cracking jokes, you're having a laugh. And they're now relaxed because they've got someone now that is not only prepared to listen to them, but they've got in their corner now a fighter, a real champion, Joe Owens, right? They know what I say I will deliver. And so they're happy again now. And also, also they've got a purpose now. They haven't given up in the ward, right? And just close the front door and to hell with it all. They're now fighting back. They're going to tell the neighbours, they're going to tell their friends, they're going to tell their work colleagues, vote Joe Owens. They know now there's someone out there for them, someone that's going to speak up for them, someone that's going to be in their corner for them, a fighter, a champion. And you have a new person. It's literally unbelievable after minutes of this despondent, demoralised resident calls, speaks to me, and then before you know it, you've got a fighter on your hands that wants to get in there now and help. So that's why we must stand in elections to gain as much support as we can, and then we'll cross that bridge whenever it comes, if ever we have to. So remember this, standing in elections wins hearts and minds. Okay, thank you.